very excited to talk to you, to you about this because you you posted this on your Instagram. You posted something um, very similar about keeping a hitting journal on your Instagram at coach underscore Cassie RB on Instagram. Um, and with keeping a hitting journal, I mentioned it, alluded to it. It's now nowadays it's easier to do than ever before because you can literally have a journal app on your phone if you're a kid, mm -hmm. um, no matter what the age, and you can record your hitting notes. You can record what you're thinking during your practice session. And I think that uh, it's so vital to, at this point, keep a hitting journal to to write down your thoughts and, and keep just everything in perspective. Yeah, I, I re actually, I recommend it to all my athletes. And if, you know, I, I'll mess around with a couple of different options with them. I'll, I'll add a shared note. So mm -hmm. um, if anyone has an Apple user, you can have a shared note where I update, I say, hey, uh, what's your focus for today? And they'll respond with, uh, I'm struggling with the outside pitch. I want to try to drive opposite field. That seems so simple. And you can be like, hey, is that even a hitting journal? And yes, that's the start of one, at least. It's the start of the practice of reflection. It's the start of the practice of saying, okay, let me document what I've worked on uh, in the month of October. Uh, and, and part of the reason too is, you know, I have athletes right now who are like, I feel great. My confidence is high. Awesome. Like, wouldn't it be nice for the next time you start to feel low to be able to go back and be like, when, what was I doing when I was feeling yeah. well, you know, and, mm -hmm. and try to re, you know, rewrite that. Um, I actually, I, I honestly, I plan this. I just realized um, when I was 11, my, if so, if anyone's watching on YouTube, my, uh, one of my friends gave this to me as uh, a present and my first journal entry um, is oh, from you gotta read it. 2002. Um, wow. It was going over runner awareness. Um, I was trying to write plays uh, apparently for bunt, the bunt coverage. And uh, yeah, that's, I guess where it started. What was the, what was the date? 2002. So well, 1 11, 2002. January. Wow. So this is 20 years old. I didn't even think of that. Yeah. I was in sixth grade. People can guess my age based <laughs> off that. Yeah. I was in sixth grade at St. Joan of Arc school. Mm. Yeah, I was yeah. six or seven. That was right. That was right after 9-11, actually. Now, yep. now that I think mm -hmm. about it. 20 yep. years old. Why did you keep that? I don't know. It's just it was just neat. Like I have a bunch of different. So I can, I, OK, so what else is in it? Uh, has uh, it well, OK, so I think I, I must have taken a break. I have a couple from 2002, a couple mm -hmm. from 2003, but then 2004 hits. And that was my first year of high school ball. Mm -hmm. Um, so this is, uh, like, okay. So I really, this is Oh five. So April 1st, 2005, Yorktown at Horace Greeley, we lost three, nothing. I wrote down what I did in my at bats when I got a hit, if I struck out and then I wrote notes on the pitcher and then I did it for the next three games too. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. And then I guess I wrote down bat at 45 degree angle on your shoulder helped you get on plane. So there you go. 2005 Cassie and you also <laughs> wow and you were saying on plane back then I so guess you had, so. you had advanced hitting knowledge in 2005 I had you, you know what? I had 15. I had coaches yeah I definitely had coaches uh help out with that and then so it just seems like it was like a random notebook after that with like some notes here and there my first visit at Alabama oh how about that you gotta read that <laughs> okay this was Please. Uh, let's see. This was Alabama 2000. Oh, no, that was the fall. So this was my visit was then here. Uh, Friday, February 16th. It was flew down from Philly to Chicago, then to Birmingham. Got to talk to coach Patrick Murphy, got caught in traffic, missed a meeting with the president because of traffic. Finally got there, got to meet Murphy in the parking lot and he gave us all hugs instead of a handshake. That's the journal. I'm <laughs> and you've told that story before about, I know. Hug. Yeah.